be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. And with that, a hey and welcome to another Let's Play! I'm a game I was very excited to play. But first, I need to check the settings. Hold on. Yeah, no, it should be good. Yeah. I should be fine. Okay. <clears throat> so, if you don't know where we are, or how we got here, we need to get to the lighthouse. So, let's go do that. There it is, there's the lighthouse. That's a pretty bad storm. Jesus. Holy shit. So surreal. Child famously called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. So there you go, Victoria. Why yes. Arbus? Because Maybe of her we images of hopeless dating. faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those Wait. sad mothers and children. Look. She saw humanity look. as torture, yeah, I right? Look. And frankly, it's Can't bullshit. Look. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of Why desperation. Isn't it working? And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Most button right towards the oh. What if Arbus chose to cap Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Why? Looks pretty good to me. I really like the scenery. Like all the pictures in the background and the light and then there's our little dance. Sure people at the height of their beauty or innocence. She had a brilliant eye. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. She could have taken I should upgrade to the 21st century. <laughs> I have to but I like I'm it old school. Of her work. I, I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Me too, Victoria. Uh, come on, he captured the essence of poetry. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Damn. October 1. October. My favorite month. The best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. But it's still too damn hot. Thanks, global warning. Warn. <laughs> GG me. Global warning. Definitely. Who doesn't know about global warning? And I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters of scary movies yet. Soon, Kate let me borrow the October Country by Ray Birdie. Br 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 fucking hell. <clears throat> I can't read. I don't know why, but I struggle to read. <laughs> God damn it, I'm sorry. I haven't, read I haven't read much by him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek creed before I helped up my cop of battle ro battle ro oh, fucking hell. Oh my copy- I can't read- I swear to God, I'm so sorry. <clears throat> up my copy of Battle Royal. But he nails the autumn atmosphere of small towns. The last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a real Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social <laughs> Sounds like me. It's that or a Votex Club stroke fest swimming party. Stro Strokey? F I don't know if I pronounce that. Or is that Vex Strokey Fest? You so punny, Max. Well, at least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. 
like I said, I can't read. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy. As my parents love telling me on a loop, you have all the time in the world. Hey, for who? Gosh, there's a lot. Oh, there we go. Let's do a Oh. Oh, hey, look. People. I've seen these people. Okay. Who swore beat America. And there was honesty about the economic conditions. My little conditions camera bag is battered, but <laughs> still kicking. Beauty in the struggle. You, you don't have beauty without a beat. Which I do love my, my analog camera. I should take a quick picture. With an analog camera? Of the 1950s. Well, don't you fucking do that with a cell phone, that though? that iconic shot of Kerouac on the balcony. And if you have I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Plus, it's perfect for your say portfolio. So? You dig? Now, shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Um... I did know. I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, He's Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. Oh, I know who I don't the like. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook. Or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Hi, Kate. Oh, no, she Hi, really Max. doesn't look good. You seem quiet today. Just thinking too good. much. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. She's sorry for her. She didn't deserve to have the fucking paper ball thrown at her fucking face. Obviously Blackwell spent bank on the computers Just here. like every school. <laughs> Looks like somebody was already working on this. Hey, cool. look at this Photoshop. Take examples of this, people. This is how you Photoshop. Look. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this.